What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got some Star Wars news, but before we do get into that, remember, hit the subscribe, like, and notification bell so you're always in the know on everything Star Wars. And also, we are fast approaching 5,000 subscribers, so y'all know what y'all gotta do. Hit that subscribe button so we get the video and the channel trending overall. So, without further ado, let's get into today's episode. Now, we got some mind-blowing news that's gonna blow your socks off. Yes, we're finally getting something that George Lucas had deleted for a little while, but it looks like disney's bringing this back and we can thank a couple people for that now this isn't just any old creature guys this is something like i said that is a george lucas dream come true now for 47 years this incredible design has been sitting on the shelf waiting for its moment to shine and now with the skeleton crew we're finally going to get the creatures of the shistavin now it's a funny name but for 47 years like i said it's something that has been on the shelf now we all know george lucas has a soft spot for creatures and this species is one of those legendary designs that never quite made it to the big screen but thanks to John Watts, Chris Ford and the Skeleton Crew team and like I said it could be that Dave Filoni has something to do with it as well we're finally getting to see this awesome creature in action now it's like a cosmic wink from the Star Wars gods or something because it's a testament to the rich history of the universe and passion of the people that are bringing this to life so it's not only that we are getting a cool badass werewolf pirate but we're also honoring george lucas's vision in a way now it's not the whole entire vision so don't get your hopes up i know you guys are probably like this is definitely not that it's not his but it's cool that they are taking something that he did want to work on at some point and they're giving it to the a taste of it in this series as we know that this is a brand new series we've never heard of these characters never even seen them obviously you know we've seen pictures and stuff like that but we're still awaiting more things to come out as this comes out later this year now there is also some rumor that we're going to be getting a trailer for the upcoming series at some point during d23 now we still don't know when that is but that is a good thing because now we can get a closer look at what the series is going to look like and knowing that jude law's character is a former jedi it's interesting to see how this is going to all play out, but I'm curious to see what is going to be involved in this trailer. We know we're going to be getting Vane from The Mandalorian, and the last time we saw him, he had abandoned Gorian Shard and fled after an aerial battle against Din and his allies. So there is a lot that we should be getting in this trailer, as we do see that he is a part of everything that's going on at D23, at least from the behind-the-scenes stuff that we're getting so far, because again, I'm not there, so I can't give it to you but with breaking news at d23 but i can give it to you from my house at home on here on youtube guys stick around i'm gonna be having more news as d23 keeps going with the latest star wars stuff and i'll catch you guys in tomorrow's video and don't forget remember hit the subscribe like and notification bell so you're always in the know